rejected by Papianis. PG is huge, literally and figuratively, to the team, you know? Knocked down, big Giorgios Papagiannis. PG will be huge for us. I think you can mark my words. PG will be one of the best big guys in your league, if not the best. You've got Papagiannis with the rejection. At 2 meters 20, Georgios Papagiannis is the cornerstone of Panathinaikos OPAP Athens. Fourth in blocks last season, PG is establishing himself as one of the most dominant centers in the Euro League. Papagiannis with another block. I think the most important thing is the timing. Uh, besides that, positioning is really important. And, uh, you know, uh, just to have to be on the right time, and you have to take the, the chances. You know, really change the momentum of the team, and uh, it really pushes you. Rejected by Papa Giannis. The defender has to calculate the time that the ball is going to go to the basket, and you really have to take the chances because you don't want to make the foul. It gives you a really big uh, boost to your energy, and really pushes the ball at the other uh, end of the floor to go to the offense, and maybe you can get a dunk from that. Papa Giannis with another rejection. His fourth block shot of the night, and then finished at the other end by Ioannis Parpetru. Unbelievable, like a uh, seven, seven foot, more than seven foot guy, moving like, like a guard, running up and down the court uh, faster than anybody, jumping, catching the ball for alley oops, uh, shot blocking, everything is really impressive. I think he's a freak of nature. He will be huge for us. Jorgos Papagiannis rising high. I haven't been around a lot of guys with his size and his athleticism and his timing to block shots. You know, it's a, it's a rare skill to have. It seems like he blocks every shot in practice. Um, he's playing well, so he's a big part of our team and uh, I think one of the better centers in Europe. Among the league leaders in block shots again this year, Papagiannis will be pivotal as Panathinaikos targets a seventh European title. EuroLeague has a lot of big men, but they're really good uh, shot blockers. You know, I'm, I'm being good, always good at it. Um, practicing just always, every day at practice. Um, you know, chase for it, chase the blocks, and game by game and day by day, you're getting better. It's really early right now to talk about it, but we have been, let's say, the ingredients for this team, and everybody's gonna put a piece in this puzzle, in this contest, for the team to make a playoff.